Welcome to Priya Gita Diaz exhibition, The Earth and Her Skin. Priya is a young Singaporean artist who came to fame three years ago when she had gilded a portion of a staircase in her HDB estate, beautifying it magnificently. The authorities decided that uh, this might be vandalism and Priya had to remove the uh, installation made of uh, two or three layers of lovingly hand-pasted gold leaf. Following this incident, Priya acquired uh, fame thanks to the very warm reception to what she'd done uh, on media and social media. There was even a debate in the Singapore Parliament about the place of art in the city, which uh, reference at every step of the discussion what uh, Priya had done. And I can say happily that uh, Priya can be credited for promoting the place of art in Singapore. In this exhibition, Priya references a recent racist incident where she was apparently called a, well, I don't know if I can repeat this in this video, but uh, uh, it was a bad insult, apparently translated from a traditional Hokkien slur that reference, uh, a part of the word reference, a snake. So that's why in this work, uh, Priya has printed uh, snake's skin and some words that uh, we see reference to the practice of uh, gilding in this work. Oh, she is the divine femme fatale. This part of the installation references uh, the artist herself with his self-portrait uh, d'après Caravaggio as a Medusa, angry Medusa. The works are placed on the carpet reminiscent of a typical home of an uh, uh, Indian family in Singapore. I mean, of a family of Indian descent here in Singapore. Priya has also cast in wax both her hands, one showing her practice as, a, uh, as an artist that uses gold, and the other expressing the anger of the woman who's been insulted. Priya feels actually that uh, while Singapore uh, promotes racial harmony and defends it with uh, some uh, strict laws, uh, that uh, racism is actually prevalent and she feels that that's her expression, uh, her experience of brownness. That's why we painted one of the gallery walls in brown, a, a brown that's reminiscent of the artist's uh, own skin color. She also references that color with uh, the works, the raw works on, la on latex uh, that come in three colors. There's a transparent that, uh, at least on this wall, will reference the, brown, the brownness. Uh, some parts of the latex are gilded, which uh, refers to a practice of uh, beautifying and transforming our environment. And some pieces of latex are black. All these have make an allusion to kink. The second part of the insult had a uh, rather derogatory sexual component to it, which in uh, some provocative way the artist is responding to with uh, sexual innuendos of the, of the works. The black is also here because in her experience as a brown woman, Priya says, the brown body is a black body. It's uh, printed on uh, this limited edition print. Brown bodies and black body complete many times. Perhaps that is the moon primary school. It's also apparent on the video work where Priya uh, 
has uh, is playing uh, with the black paint, covering herself, her back at least, a bit of her hair, with black paint. Interestingly, the way the video piece is lit, her skin looks uh, relatively pale. Uh, however, she makes this point, uh, putting an equivalence between the brownness and the blackness. The blackness, which we see also in those plants, uh, Priya has painted black leaves, in fact, artificial leaves. Um, shown here in an antique frame and beautified with rhinestones. As an artist, Priya strongly believes that uh, her duty is to beautify her environment. Which she does at the bit. The sexual innuendos are present again with uh, the whip, the Maya whip, made of artificial hair. So there was no degradation of artist hair in the process of making this artwork. Next to it, an installation humorously called Celestial Bodies. Uh, using stockings and gold implements. And next to it on the this Indian carpet is a photo work documenting one of Priya's performances showcasing well is it nudity or is it uh, or is she dressed with uh, gold-plated Priya. And again, we have the leaf and latex works on this white wall. The earth and her skin is curated by Kimberly Shen, who uh, won the Impact Award uh, last year, together with Priya Vita Adia. And Priya won as one of the two artists winning the Impact Award. The other artist was Yen Chen. Uh, Kimberly was the winning curator. They uh, befriend each other following this win, as uh, they, they, they were able to spend a few days together in New York as part of the, uh, as part of the award. The exhibition is on at Apotos Gallery, Room 1, until May 3, 2020. Questions, inquiries are more than welcome.